Yo, whoa, what is going on YouTube? It's your boy Dan, aka Dropper. You guys, some pixel mod, baby. We're doing it here on the Pocket Pixels Red server. If you missed the last one, I got two, not one, but two Rainbow Infernapes. You already know about it. And we took out the gym, and it didn't go super well. I have this beautiful. I mean, look at look at the mascara and that eyeliner. I don't even know what what is. You would think I'd have a clue. No, I don't. But anyway, we're doing some red action. So if you guys want to play with me, you guys can go to getpixelmon.com. You can play for free today on the Pocket Pixels Red server at play.pocketpixels.net. Super duper simple stuff. I think what we're going to do today is I really want to do this gym battle again, right? So like in the last one, in the last episode, I had the gym battle and I got, sh I wouldn't say wrecked. I mean, I didn't win though. You know, obviously we were trying to win and I didn't win. So this was the team I had and I thought I was going to win and I got swept by belly drum. Uh, zoom ray roll so we would have been fine if casper had um like focus sash so i think that like that's the kind of fix right i think like fixing that and then maybe giving um bullet punch to professor x might help too or like thunder punch or something just so i don't get swept by a zoom roll again but i'm gonna see that gym leaders on and then we'll just kind of mess around and see what we can do so i actually do have a focus sash already so i feel i feel like we can do this though i really do so I just found this dude, Orvim, here, who's gonna hook me up with some ability tokens, which is really nice of him. Uh, I don't know if I have anything of, of value to kind of give it him, but I'll try to figure something out. So I just gave Orvim one of my Rainbow Infernapes, because I didn't really need to, and uh, I definitely need to get change the ability on Mojito to Technician. <laughs> there we go. <laughs> That's what we needed to do. And he's immediately a lot better. So a bunch of the gym leaders are on, but the one I'm looking for is not. So I just sent a message to see if someone will hop on. In the meantime, we'll do a little uh, little Shawnee rendezvous and see if I can find anything cool. You already know I'm popping those shiny boost tokens. Let's get it. <gasps> There's a shiny right there, shiny Krabby. First one, where is it? I see it on my radar. That was so fast, dude, legitimately minutes. And it should be over here somewhere. Where is it? It says it's over here. There it is. Yeah, Shiny Krabby, let's go, dude. <laughs> what a start, man. I feel like I've had such bad luck Shiny hunting for so long in Pixelmon. And it's nice to finally turn it around and get one right away, like legitimately minutes, not even minutes, like moments. 52% landing the Shiny Krabby, 52% IVs. Let's take a look at it. There it is, my boy Cookie. I actually really like Krabby and Kingler. And even G-Max is sick, let's see. It is sassy nature, huge. No ribbon though, no ribbon though, but you already know we're gonna name him Cookie. And I'm all about that, dude. This, that's a that's a good pickup for us. Like, we could use this thing. You can run like agility on it. Like, there's some things you could do with a uh, Kingler. And we could try to get G-Max too. Yo, that's sick, look at that! What is that? Bro, this is like a coral reef or something. I think this might be one of the new biomes in, in Minecraft. Like. Well, Pixelmon got updated, I don't know, maybe a few months back to kind of this new version and it had a bunch of biomes in it that haven't been in Pixelmon ever before. And this is sick, dude. This is actually really cool. Look at this. I mean, I don't know if I'm gonna find any shinies out here, but it looks really dope. Yo, that's sick. Look at that. You got the Magikarp swimming around in here. This is so cool. Oh, it looks like someone might have built a platform out here for shiny hunting. Oh, wow. they. There's like a whole underwater cavern down here, dog. I feel like it would be so sick to build a house that was like surrounded with the walls being all this coral and stuff, but you remove the water. Like I actually feel like I want to do that, but this has to be someone's claim. Bro, look at this Aracuda, dude. <laughs> That's actually funny. That's so funny. Okay, so I've got my team ready for the gym. Let's get it. We're going right for them. And they're going to kick things off with a Grim Snarl. I'm gonna just like cross poison. This is most certainly like a dual screens grim, which is probably gonna be annoying, but uh, let's say good luck, have fun. And we'll just fire off, you know. He's gonna go for the reflect. We're gonna crit him though. What did I tell y'all? What did I tell you we we're gonna crit him? I think I was gonna crit him. So I feel like I cross poison again because the only thing he really does is set up like a light, a light screen at this point. So he actually switches out, goes hit him on top to get an intimidate. I still cross poison. I do a solid chunk with that crit. I click dual wing beat here, honestly, or I air slash. I think we air slash. I'm life orb, so I'm still dealing massive damage. Best thing he does to me is probably just like bullet punch me. So, I actually, why is there just an end? Oh, it's on the dude's head. I was so confused. I was so confused why there's an end. So I do go for the air slash. I pick up the KO, so the intimidate and the reflect does not stop me here. 
Very solid. Here comes a Gardevoir. No, I do not want to do that. Uh, I just U-turn out. It could be Scarf Vor, but I think we just U-turn. And honestly, Professor X makes the most sense here. Uh, should be able to come in. I get hit with a Psychic. It may have... Like, this is a scenario where I think we always click Agility. Because it may have Shadow Ball, but I think we still one-shot it after Agility. So, I could just go for the, the, um, the big hit. And if it Shadow Balls me, I think I live and... I get the weakness policy. So, I feel like it's a solid bet. He's gonna actually switch out to Conkelder, which is an interesting play because I get the free uh, boost there. And then I get to fire off a Zen Headbutt into the Conkelder. Doesn't do too much because of the, um, because of the Reflect. So now I'm in, a, in an interesting situation. I kinda wanna go Casper to hit him on the special side. I could also go Dawn, but then I'm taking a knockoff and I don't think that that's the play right now. I could go Wingman and go for the Air Slash as well. I'm just not convinced it's enough. I'm gonna go Wingman. I'm gonna click Air Slash. And we're gonna flinch him anyway, so it's fine. It's Guts Conk, so he's gonna blow me back with anything. The key is just like, don't get beat by Mach Punch right now. But Gengar's looking really clean against Gardevoir. He's not Scarf. Like, I feel like we should be okay at this moment. He may just switch out though, not wanting to take an Air Slash. And I should... That Reflect should be going up soon. Like, I don't think that Reflect is going to be going on forever, so... Alright, so Air Slash does come off. Take out the Kong. So, mixed Wingman. <laughs> Accidentally mixed, mixed Wingman. He wasn't even supposed to have, um, you know, both of those things. I feel like... I feel like I U-turn. I don't know if there's a way to see... No Weather, Turn 8. Okay, so this is Turn 8, so it should be up soon. I think I just U-turn here on this Gallade. And then we just go Dawn at this point. He could Swords Dance. That would be the scariest thing. Psycho Cut. There's the Reflect. It's gone. We click Willow here, I think, 100%. Or I click Hex and just deal damage to him. Because realistically, he's probably not touching me. Willow's kind of... Er, I'm just going to Hex, honestly. Like, he's going to knock off. So he had he had knock off. Yeah. All right. That's fine. I get Hex off. Doesn't do too much, but it's, it's going to weaken him. I'm basically just putting myself in that situation again where I can pretty much win with Gengar or Crobat. So that's fine. Or even honestly, you're gonna switch out go Grim Snarl again to set up the the set up the screens again. Yeah. That's smart, dude. Smart play. I mean I could definitely earthquake here, but he's gonna get his reflect back up. Which makes me wonder, should I go Mojito and try to set up and then just win with swords dances? I kinda like that play. I think I'm going big here because he's gonna set up reflect. Oh, he went for the light screen. I'm clicking swords dance. I'm clicking swords dance. Generally speaking, Grimmsnarl probably can't touch me. He goes for Reflect. I get the Swords Dance up. I have to decide, do I just take him out? Or do I potentially take damage here? I think we play safe and just Bullet Punch, honestly. Like, I want to go another boost, but... I don't see him... Like, Gardevoir dies. Gallade gets really weakened. Here comes Gardevoir. I, I honestly, I think Gardevoir still goes down here. Unless he's Babiri. It does still go down. Nice. And here comes Gallade. I think I bullet punch him anyway. It doesn't KO. Oh, it does KO. What? Let's go. GG. I didn't expect that to KO. Oh, I really didn't. This guy's got an anti hat. GG's to that. Let's get it, baby. And we can go to gym six now. So we got our fifth badge, which is very hype. I will gladly take that win. Not bad. Thank you, Sam, bro. I appreciate you. I'm just like addicted to this biome, and I just found a Lapras, which is pretty sick. Like, I really, really want to build... Like, a staircase down. I feel like this is probably claimed, but... I really want to build something down, but I, like I said, I lost the claim to my house, so... I have to figure out how do I get back to my other house. Alright, I'm just going this way and hoping I can find it. And boom, just like that, we actually did find it. Nice. Alright, so our next gym is actually Flying and Ghost. Flying and Ghost. So, we'll have to think about what makes sense there. But I'm in this dark forest. We might find some cool stuff here. Yo, another shoddy, a shoddy hoot hoot! Our second of the day. We're just getting all the yellow shinies, apparently. Okay. Uh, I can just quick pull this thing. You shouldn't have any problems with it. Dude, we get shoddy Krabby and then a shoddy hoot hoot. Not super cool, but I mean, it's 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 all right. 40% uh, IVs. But our second shiny of the day, no ribbon. Uh, that's, that's okay. We'll name you Robin Hoot, which is usually what I use for Decidueye. You're a hardy nature, ordinary growth. 
and you're gonna be pretty bad. This is a not a super strong Pokemon, but I'll take the shiny Hoodoo because why not? Two shinies already. Let's get it. You want to give me another yellow shiny? I'll take a mischievous. Let's get it. Yo, shiny Bergmite! The streak continues. Another yellow shiny, dude. And I could get. Uh, can I get his and Avalok? I gotta think of how you evolve it. Um, I have to look, but let's get it, dude. Well, quick ball it. That would be a sick, sick shiny. I mean, honestly, Avalog in general is sick, but I feel like potentially having uh, Hisuian Avalog is very cool. I just don't know how to do it. I have to look it up, but our third shiny of the day, dude, we're crushing. And they're all yellow in some way. This is what happens when you pee in the snow. We got a, a Bergmite that's a runt size, sassy nature. It's kind of cool. Own tempo. Honestly, like, I'll take it. I didn't even see that it was shiny. I only saw... By the way, shout out to Ampharos. And what is this, dude? What's over here? Um, I saw the sparkles before I saw that it was shiny, which is kind of cool. What is this thing? Bro, what? The giant star. Ooh, and a boss cub shoe. What do I get? Uh, XP candy, power anklet, and some ice. I'll take it. Yo, there's a fourth shiny. I can see it coming up on the map. Four shinies, where are you? Where are you, Vanillite? I know you're shiny somewhere. He's here somewhere. It's a pink vanilla. I know it's shiny. I got to figure out where it went. There it is. There it is, dude. We're popping off, man. No chance. No chance, dude. Four shinies, guys. Four shinies. Let's get it. Like, actually going bonkers. I've had such bad luck as of late, and I'm going to just pop off again. Another one. Yo, let's take a look. It is... Snow Cloak, so you'd have to ability capsule it to Snow Warning and nothing else. But, dude, I'll take that. Let's get it. All right, I'm popping a boost token here in the Badlands, and then we're going to throw down with some crates. Oh, this is cool. So this is called a Badlands Plateau. So there's just like a straight-up flat piece of land here. It's probably amazing for shiny hunting. No chance, dude! No chance! The hot tub luck is real, dog. The hot tub luck. Is real. Shiny Rock and Roller, our fifth shiny dude. What are we doing right now? This is crazy. And Rock and Roller is such a good shiny when it evolves. It's so good. It's so good. 43%. Bro, we are popping off. No, no marks. Sturdy's good. Bashful. Huge. I mean, it's so good. We're gonna have to, we're gonna use this thing, I think, at some point. Because, like, Gigalith is so good, dude. So good. I can't believe we legit have five shinies so far. This is wild. What an insane shiny day, though. Picking up Cookie, Bergmite, Vanillite, Rog and Rolla, and Robin Hoot. I only nicknamed some of them. Don't hate me. But I do want to do some crates. You guys know the dealio. Let's do it. Warp slash crates. Or slash warp space crates. Let's throw it out. We got a brand new one, though. Blazing Forest? And, of course, you guys can always pick up the crate keys at shop.pocketpixels.net. Okay, Rainbow Ho- Oh, Shawnee Kung Fu! I didn't even know that was in the game. Shawnee Celebi, Calyrex, Stack Attack, Entei, Rainbow, Rapidash. Some other wins here, though. Alter Volcarona. And, honestly, like, Shawnee Pineco is pretty sweet. So, let's do it. Blazing Forest. Obviously, the Rainbow Ho- Ho- would be legendary. But we're going to make it happen. And again, you guys can always go to shop.pocketpixels.net, pick up some crate keys. There's usually sales or deals going on. Lots of cool stuff. And we're going to kick it off with a Drowned Rapid Dash. You can also pick up some Shine Boost tokens, which is the key. Look at this thing. This thing is like... I don't even want to look at it. It's actually wicked. Goodbye. Let's find something else. All right, here we go. Numero Dos. What do we got? A Shiny Sea Dot. You could have just, you could have stayed in the crate, buddy. It would have been fine. Lucky number three. Here we go. Here we go. Shiny Pinecone. I'll take it. It's actually one I wanted. I did want Shiny Pinecone. Fortress is legit. Don't sleep on Shiny Fortress. Look at these people sitting here. Hey, guys. He's got a quackle on his head. And Cherubi. Womp womp. Uh, let's keep going. Let's keep going. Let's see what we got here. So far, best hit, I would say, would be that Pineco, but we still got this one and five more. And Cherubi again. All right, we got five more. Let's go. Wait, there's a Sableye, too? What's up, Sableye? Yo, there's a lot of Pokemon here. Jeez. What do we got? Yo! <laughs> Let's go, dude. We are just so good at this. We're so good at this. 
We're so good at this, dude. Every time. Every time. You can't. You can't beat it. You can't beat it. I mean, we just we just pop off every single time, dude. The rainbow ho-oh. I just... We got it. And I still have four keys to go. So good, dude. I think that's three episodes in a row I've gotten a rainbow out of the crates. So good, dude. 2% rainbow ho-oh. My luck is bonkers, dude. Test yours. See if you can get yourself a rainbow ho-oh as well. Honestly, I think that's better than the cup food, but I'll take the cup food right now too. Like, that's cool. If you want to give me the cup food too, like, that's fine. A shroomish? Hey, I'm all right with that. Breloom's cool. I'll take a shiny shroomish. I'll take a shiny shroomish. All right, let's see. We got a couple more, a couple more. Give me, give me the cup food, dude. That'd be hilarious. And stack attacka, dude. I really like stack attacka. It's so good, dude. Oh my gosh, stack attack is so good, dude. Trick room is very good on this dude. Um, I could just go under him. Hello, wild, bro. Like we have two left, and I, I already hit. I hit the th two percent stack attacka. It was a one percent ho. Oh, even wild, even more wild, even more wild, dude. We hit the 2% stack attack of the 1% ho oh. I just, I don't know. There's a Vika Volt right here. What are you up to? Time flush. <laughs> dude, I got one more. I got one more and then I'm done, dude. Oh my gosh. Our luck today has been actually the best it's been, I would say, in months playing Pixamon. I'm not even gonna lie. Like five Shawnees plus crazy pulls. I got, I got a Sizzlepeed. I'm not even mad. I'm not even mad, dude. Come play with me on the Pocket Pixel server, guys. We're going to start streaming again. We got weekly posts. You already know about it. I'd love to see you. We're going to do all sorts of fun stuff. Play it out, pocketpixels.net. I'll see you guys there. Come play. I'll see you guys next time. Peace.